Hey folks, just wanted to do a quick uh, look at of these Racer Star motors that have been getting some pretty good reviews lately. I got the 2205 uh, 2600 KV version. I see there's like a couple different series. Um, you got like a BR and a RS or something like that. These are the RF 2205s. Um, they're, I guess, considered a little higher end version of them. Come in a nice little box here. Um, what I thought was kind of cool about these is they had a uh, set screw instead of the typical clip like everything else has. Uh, from what I can tell it takes a one and a half millimeter and it's a little bit loose so I'm going to take these apart before I put them on and uh, a little dab of Loctite as everything gets just to make sure they don't come loose. And see, so I'm gonna go ahead and pull this one apart. I'm curious to see what it actually looks like. So we've got a little, looks like a little washer in there. So we can pull this apart. Some looking windings. Big old magnets in there. A lot thicker than the. Uh, let's see if I've got it around here somewhere. This is from a ready to fly quads bell. I don't know if you can really tell. This is the racer star here. Look a lot thicker. I think the uh, ready to fly quads are recessed in a little bit, maybe with a little ring on the top edge here, but they look pretty good. I don't see, I don't see any counterbalance stuff in there. So they're either perfectly made or they're going to wobble a little bit. I guess we'll see. It seems awfully thin. sure how close my camera will focus here but it looks like it's made pretty well put it back together goes back together easily um, put this guy back on there you go unfortunately these are sold in sets of four so you can't get all clockwise or all counterclockwise. It's two clockwise, two counterclockwise, so I get to go back to fighting with that. But it comes with the typical stuff the uh, bell style nuts, the acorn nuts, whatever these are called, and then just a bunch of mounting screws. So I'll be getting putting the typical nylon lock, lock nuts on there just to prevent it from backing out these seem pretty nice they're very solid seem like they're built well not not no play in the bearings or in the bell or anything solid shaft on there which is nice to see I I don't, uh, everything I've used has been solid, but I've seen a lot of people complain that the hollow ones tend to break. Obviously, you snug them down, they stretch, and a few times after that, it, it's going to break. So, that's that one. Not too bad. The RF 2205 2600 by Racer Star. Uh, if you don't mind waiting a little while for them to come from Banggood, that seems to be the only place that carries them. It took. Uh, right at about a month to get here because I ordered them right around Christmas. So expect to wait. But these look pretty good. Um, I will be probably putting them on before too much longer. Um, my quad kind of needs an overhaul and I kind of like it 
as it is right now, it's just kind of a beater. I'm trying new stuff and learning new things and kind of not afraid to crash it as of right now because all the stuff is pretty wore out. So hopefully I'll be able to tune my flying a little bit on the on the wobbly quad as it is right now and then put these on and give these a go see how they work out. Those are the RF2205 2600 KV racer star motors. <laughs>